Oke guys, kita lanjut ke game yang kedua antara IP Brand melawan Homeboy. Oke, so it is. Udah lemah sih pakai Valentina guys ya. Sepak dia pakai. Ini mah Dino bakar guys jadinya guys. Up just yet, oh, and looking at this, it is sworn on the uh, Guinevere. Yeah. So this is uh, for homeboys to actually have that set up, and I think uh, uh, yeah, that that final pick actually kind of made us scratch our heads and say, okay, where is everybody uh, gonna be placed at? So far, AP Brand doing really well here in the gold lane, still able to keep it up here so, with so. nets. But Flap is gonna be the one prioritized here by homeboys. Yeah, Wow, did you see the flicker out from Flap T Z? He actually <laughs> flickered out when uh, Chibi was actually gonna go in for the yeah, for yeah, for the ultimate there. Like that Dark Knight falls and he's like, Okay, I feel like I can still sustain this and you know with the chemistry that AP Brand has, they had that backup. Kyle TZ was able to pick up that first kill. Overall, AP Brand is just winning it so far here and they're prepared to take on to homeboys. Let's see if uh, Homeboys can actually go in for a steal here because he's still in the Dark Knight Falls to actually steal in the objective here. Kyle TZ going to be working up this first turtle. Sword does not have that uh, ultimate just yet, so AP Brand can take this without any contest, not unless Chibi comes in. Adi Lampu. Yeah, Chibi, Chibi comes in, Dark Knight Falls is out, but he can slow down. Ogwin was right hit. there waiting for him to come in. As soon as the Dark Knight Falls went in, he got put down. Zorn looking for an escape to get flicker yeah. to get himself away. Sumpah lah, tiga purify cuy. Maksudnya bisa ulti kah? Super Marco. Super Marco, though, it's a different story here on the bottom side. We did mention that um, the carry is gonna have a hard time uh, up against this Harriet that has a little bit more advantage when it comes to the range. As you can see, Owen already rotating towards this bottom side to give a little bit more of that assistance to Marco. Yeah, and I, I want to say a good read by Nets right now. He's he smells something in the water. He's just like, okay, something's up down here. I, I know there's got to be a Ogwen must be near. Net, oh, net, they do actually net. call catch him. Oh, the Zaman Force is <laughs> out <laughs> trying to help Super Marco. He does catch a kill. Ogwen unable to help and has to watch his teammate go down. It is now tied one one for Philippines, Homeboys and AP Red. <laughs> Yeah, the thing here so about the uh, homeboys is that they understand that uh, the so fact that Jangan Net can actually recall. pretty much uh, pressure dunia, bro. Super Marco on his lane. That's why you see the rotations mostly going towards the XP here. As Flap is gonna get pressured on. Oh. You pop in that last incendiary and he actually gets Sepat. Okay. And this is what I was saying, right? The Barretts does not have that much mobility. Plus the fact that it only has to flicker out. So up against the export, it's not it's not really gonna be that good when it comes to the laning phase. Yeah, I, and that's the, that's the, uh, the unfortunate when you're trying. Oh, Chibi might be getting caught Chibi. here. Oh, this flicker oh, here Chibi. comes. Lampu, the, uh, oh, Dark Knight Falls is out. We do have a pop up there. Ah, oh, the Kyle yeah. Tizzy looking for the damage. Zaman Force really? later, so he's Ooh, crawling away. Bro. And Matilda able to use that ability to get him out of harm's way, but he still goes tumbang, yeah. down. You can see the value coming, Flap Tizzy, with the flicker. Still takes a whole heap of the damage, guys. and Nom Nom's first a pat able to eat up Flap Tizzy. And they're gonna claim a kill yeah, three to three a piece here. Yeah, the side of Homeboys was able to Turtle get kedua, some of the trade offs, and with that pick off onto Kyle TZ, Homeboys gonna be able to CB. take this one in. Not that, unless there's gonna be any contestants. Nah, yeah. Okay, gonna be taken in <laughs> by the Homeboys, and this time they actually kind of clap back here up against the side of AP Bren. Ooh, a Nets and a Zorn looking to put the damage on. We do have a Violet Requiem on Kyle TZ, yeah, but sorry. I mean, that's a big take in that box. Yeah. Now here comes the rest of the team trying to chase down Ogwen and Kyle TZ, but they're going to go ahead and use that Guiding Wind to get themselves to safety. Okay, so Pat also actually moved down towards this bottom side, actually sharing a little bit of those gold creeps with Nets. So let's see if that will actually uh, make much of a difference here because so far it is fine because uh, Nets is actually winning in the lane. They might actually go in for the switch right now just as it Flap hits easy, the 5 minute mark to be able to get in at least some trade sword though. 
Tries to go in for flap TD. It's a little bit Sorry. techy. Let's see if Hope Boys can actually take him down. Yeah, they do run the pop out of a flap kind of TD. He might be in a little bit of trouble here. Ubiu finding like this, the kill there as well. Bringing him up. Uh, Homeboy is now up one kill to AP Bren right now. Gold pretty much tied for both of them right now still. Uh, looking at uh, especially the advantage. AP Brent has the advantage with the towers and the advantage for kills going to homeboys. Yeah, it's funny too. Like, I only noticed that right now. You were so busy thinking about yeah, where these low, heroes yeah. are going to be going in for homeboys. I actually didn't notice that it is a three man purify here for AP Brent just to cancel <laughs> out the uh, setups here coming out from Zorn. So, I think here for the homeboys is they have to make sure that all these damage dealers. If they don't have that purify, it is the time to go up uh, for the setup or maybe waste out those purifies before those big clashes. But so far, homeboys right now, they are at least they've traded in the towers after taking in that uh, second turtle of the game. Yeah, and uh, it's, I mean, I, I, I do like that Sapat's kind of rotating around now. He's able, outside of the laning, uh, the laning start of this game, I mean, the laning, he was going to have the biggest problem uh, because uh, his whole kit is based on being able to kind of kick and maintain his uh, stacks. Now we're starting up on the turtle. We're about half health right now. You can see Flap, TZ. Oh, Nets actually oh, might be trouble. Force has drop, but he gets taken down quickly mm -hmm. by the Nana. This yeah. will leave it open for Chibi to take the turtle. Last Insanity is out looking oh, for Zorn. So so Puts on the damage and that might... Nope. To we're going to be able to use that dash to get away. So, I mean, you get a kill, but Homeboy's able to get themselves another turtle. While you see now the pressure with the numbers in their favor, AP Bren now starting to put some pressure onto the mid lane but decide against pressing their advantage. Yeah, the thing here about Homeboys and AP Brin in that uh, final turtle crash here. Oh, although Flap TZ here. Can we go back with some deal once again? Oh, deal. <laughs> They've been going at it ever since game number one, though. <laughs> They've been able to survive. But uh, yeah, just as I was saying, um, you know, AP Brin kind of understood that the uh, Homeboys had the prime position there. They were able to take the turtle, so they went for nets instead. Pressure the gold lane for the turtle take so still some nice trade-offs there across the board for ap brand and looking at the gold lead here it is gonna be homeboys leading by 1k just because of the fact that they actually took in at least two turtles for this game but ap brand still leading in terms of control over the map they've taken in two of the towers 50 seconds before the first lord is up and i think uh, homeboys if they want to create some pressure they can actually take in the store they do have the dark night yeah, and, and that's going to uh, prove uh, uh, vital when it comes to uh, the last seconds of trying to take this Lord. If they can kind of maintain their space in there. You've got Sapat who can kind of tank a lot of the damage, who's going to be able to sit in the Lord pit and uh, really kind of like uh, claim it. Whereas Chibi is going to have to really be very careful about when he comes in to try to get those needles in or to get that Dark Knight Falls to get that retribution onto it. We do see the Kyle Tz in close resistance here. But Zorn gonna go ahead, dive himself to safety. Yep, 15 seconds. I think everybody here for AP Brand, they're doing their best to poke uh, homeboys here so that they try to go back to their base, heal up that HP before this first major objective. Nah, so Lord we're just also looking for someone to take down with the uh, the setups that the Guinevere has. But it's not gonna be easy. Three purifies here that haven't been used just yet. And so far the pressure is gonna be hey, on hey, to hey, the Owen, Okay, Owen, so Owen, though. Oh, yeah, this. speaking of the purifies, we do have a Detona's welcome that lands sure. on Marco, to yeah. Super yeah. Marco. Nets able to find the kill there. That is going to be one down for AP Bren. They're looking immediately to go oh, for this killer. Lord right after they get that kill. The Lord, focus on them is, is, is uh, remarkable. Yeah, I mean, yeah, uh, Marco was uh, isolated there. He was with Ogwen that was trying to get him to safety. Nah, but uh, Zorn... They had that purifying yeah, up, man, man. but the rest of homeboys was just working on them. They get <laughs> in this first lord of the game. Nets. Yeah, Nets. and now we have the Zaman Force laid out there. Still Nets, Nets in trouble <laughs> on the side. Gets taken out by Ogwen, and they're going to be able to get Flap TZ to safety. They get, the, hey? they do get the Lord. Uh, they lose I'm one nice. in the process in the ensuing fight of it. But I want to say, I mean, Homeboy's doing a good job of being able to waste out these purifies. You're going to have the Violet Requiem coming out from Zorn, and then Sapat is right there behind to scoop them up with that Daytona's welcome. 
<laughs> yeah, bottom side too. Like home boys is doing their best to pressure. Malik, Kirar, Rora, and at least capitalize this uh, lead that they have Sheesh. up against AP Brand by at least taking in the, the the outer turrets here and maybe going in for the second. It's a relatively low kill count here for both sides, right? Like both are trying to take in as much objectives as they can. Kaltizi gonna be working up this uh, purple buff, but it seems like the target all the time will be a flap TZ that is able to soak up all of the damage here. Uh, yeah, that, it, uh, and that's a Zorian going ahead and lands onto Flap Teasy, but Flap Teasy is going to get away there. I don't think he has the Violet Requiem. Here comes a circling eagle onto Gil. He decides, he decides Algwin decides against the continuing game, the pop-up there. AP Red able to very quickly uh, take down this Lord, and not the Luminous Lord there, but I want to say it might be a little bit harder uh, once we move on to these next ones. Yeah, Flap TZ right now, he is uh, been the one frontlining apart from Kyle TZ. What's making it really hard here too is that most of the time, right, like the Zorn's uh, pickoffs here onto either uh, Super Marco or Few, right? That you do have the Guiding Wind or the Guiding Wind out, but sometimes it's not enough once you get surrounded here by Homeboys. You still <laughs> got the Detona Swell coming, coming out from uh, Sepat, so there is a lot of things to consider here for AP Bren. Unfortunately enough, the Golding is not that far. Perhaps like uh, either Marco, yeah. they take down uh, Chibi before the, the Lord comes up, Nets, or maybe Nets. even try to get a singular pick off here. But Flip. here comes Zorn. Yeah, we do have a pop up there. Yeah, the Flap armor TZ armor is terrified away. Has no more Kyle armor. He's gonna have to back up. Kyle TZ in a little bit of trouble. <laughs> has activated that. Semua bisa selamat karena mati lu dah guys. La 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 la. Dark Knight falls is out. Pick up the old Tilo. Son, aku terlalu dalam. Son in trouble gets taken down by Flap TZ. Kyle TZ gets taken down by Super Marco. Now Nets in trouble. Trying to dance his way around. Nets in trouble. Is he gonna be able to find the kill on the Super Marco while Flap? Dua tukar satu ya. What? Duntal bro. Yes, picked up the uh, corrosion side and the golden staff. Maybe perhaps going going in for uh, the demon hunter sword as his next item. The uh, gold lead is gonna go to Nets when it comes to the gold lane. Eight thousand for him, and Super Marco is still behind by a thousand. Thirty-five thousand yeah. for the homeboys. They're looking to take mm. in this lord. Let's see if they might manage to get in a pick off. Swords already setting something up there up top. <laughs> he does not have the conceal though. Yeah, so he's, he's waiting. We're at the Lord, just down to about 10%. Looking for a bait. I think homeboys are very confident in their ability to team fight this. So they're kind of very slow playing this Lord. They're dragging it out. They want to know where AP Bren is on the map right now. But as they're doing that, as they're kind of slow playing it, they've got minions starting to make their way towards their towers. Lord pulls out again and goes ahead and gets reset. Probably a, run, a very frustrating day for the Lord here. Doesn't know if they want to fight, doesn't know if they want to leave. Leave him alone. They're coming oh, back cool. and forth. You can see now Lord, yang kedua, guys, yeah. and AP Bren. Sorry, but put Masih the damage onto the Lord at about Itu half health 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 right now. Yeah. Still looking for the opportunity. Chibi, it gets dragged out again. <laughs> They're dancing around this. And mm -hmm. nobody, each team looking for the first one to make a mistake. Ooh, deal goes in a little bit close. Here comes the circling mm -hmm. Hazel <laughs> taking with him Flap TZ into the back lines, but be careful they all reset back on the map half health for this lord <laughs> yeah even the lord can get confused oh few yeah AP Brand can just go for this lord and that is gonna be confused like it's over we're just gonna be taking this AI I take down Chibi I take it to the lord and AP Brand baru aja kemarin guys ya tahun kemarin eh tahun baru malah menang tidak perlu recall recall nomor satu itu slogannya sorn ya guys ya Gak apa-apa, gak menang. Yang penting recall recall. Apalagi recall recall depan juara dunia ya. Nilai plus guys itu guys.
Oh, that's interesting. Owen just picked up the uh, blood wings here just to add up to that additional flap, magic flap. damage and the shields. Malada. The bottom lane is bare though. Wado si B. Wala mati guys. Straight in for the base as AP Brand is gonna be forcing out the fight here. Chibi is down. As whole boys one member down as the Lord's gonna be knocking in their base. Yeah, already at the core right now. They have to have an answer for it. Unfortunately, Chibi a little late with that Dark Knight Falls. Still gets caught by Super Marco. Uh, a little bit slower of a game. We talked about it not matching up in the mid uh, game. We do have a Last Insanity out. Udil is a backing off. Super Marco puts the finishing touches on that mid tower. Now we are at the core. Just one more. Uh, well, actually, we have two towers up at the top. Uh, yeah. A high ground and the uh, oh, tier two. There it goes. Two finds the mid we only have one more high ground is homeboy is going to be able to stop this last insanity to try to zone them <laughs> out Mark super marco puts the finishing touches on the high ground and they all decide against uh pursuing this any further they got one more lord and it does look like homeboys uh might be at the the last minutes of their game yeah 4k instantly went back to ap bren just like that after that pick off uh, by few on the chibi right and this is what we were saying about the nana it can instantly burst you down like that once you get caught into uh, you you get that molina and then the nana pops in that molina blitz you can just one hit the lead like even the tankiest heroes in the game is already taking up so much damage from that nana but it seems like hey, 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 Udil, 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 they just commit for this Kaltis is gonna go in winter guys spot probably mortal Super Marco mati. Bibi hati hati. Pasti tumbang bro. Okay, Actually forced the back away trying to get in that purple buff. Homeboys has to check their base too because oh, it, they don't have any of these inhibitors. Yang ketiga ya. Brand, Masih level 2 guys pastinya. Control, Harusnya belum and bisa end sih. The numbers advances are towards their side. Kita lihat aja nanti ya. Actually, few landed in that nice Molina Blitz once again to be able to take down two members of Homeboys. And with the safety of that guiding wind from Owen, yeah. it's just able to, you know, yang sia -sia, guys. let AP Brand evade these clashes nah. that they don't want to happen. Ooh. Sakit banget. Flat easy goes in. He does get caught. banget guys ya. Oh Gwen. Oh Gwen. Oke. Untung aja netnya dia pakai Ipurat ya. Kalau dia pakai lethal ignition mungkin udah tumbang guys Oh Gwen ya. Kali. Kali play dulu bro. Yeah, let's uh, the last insanity be popped there by uh, Flap TZ. Actually, I think he thought he could have at least taken down Sepat there or Udil, but at the same time, uh, Homeboys had that guys. answer with Sorn. He was punished at that point, and AP Brand said, okay, let's stop at that. Let's not go for more. And they just went in and went back because if they actually pushed in for more, Homeboys could have actually uh, punished AP Brand at that point. So 18 minutes in, it is actually still AP Brand in the lead right now. 2k for a side, 9 turrets in. This last Lord could actually seal the deal for Homeboys if uh, they, they managed to... Oh, sorry, it could be the deal here for AP Brand if they managed to steal in this Lord. Oh, yeah, Winter Trench right udah dimainkan oleh Udil ya. Eh, CB. Nak kemana CB? Nak kemana? Langsung beli Immortal guys dia guys. Winter, Winter CB, Winter. Nah, gak kober ya. <laughs> Ogwen uh, very oh, wisely okay. using uh, that guiding wind to get out of harm's way. Oh, Tizi. Checks the bush. Mm -hmm. Does oh, get popped up by Zorn, who decides not to put on the Violet Requiem. The rest of AP Bren in the midst of this purple buff, forcing out homeboys. They say this is their jungle now. Yeah, the thing is, uh, Kyle Tizi is not going to be easy to take down here, right? Uh, pretty much like the Fredrin. Once it gets the items <laughs> here, it can pretty much counter out. Uh, Ada robot terbang tadi ya. Uh, a radiant armor being picked up there by Kyle TZ and the Guardian's helmet to add up to this uh, innate tankiness already. 60 seconds in, I think for the homeboys here, you know, set up here for Zorn, but it's not gonna be easy. Everybody still has their purify up. Plus they have to deal with the insane burst that Few has and the outs that they can actually do in the clashes with Ogwen's Guiding Wind. 
Yeah, so much a burst on their side, and it just takes one mistake. Like I said, all uh, you were talking about it. All few needs to do land one ability, and it's over for yeah. at least one member of the homeboys. <laughs> uh, so, and then that is just quite a, a, an amount of damage and quite a lot of frustration and lagi none of full damage. Yeah, 20 minutes in. I think at this point, <laughs> everybody damage, pretty much yeah. has the items that they need to have. It's all about the execution. It's all about the decision making between these two teams. One mistake. Yeah, Lord E4, cuy. Lord penentuan. So Kalau yang dapat AB brand here. udah pasti menang. Hey. Well. <laughs> oh, okay. Kali ya, guys ya, ya kali. Namanya juga ya kali tipi, guys. Lord Dance, Kyle T is gonna be working up, starting up this Lord. Chief can actually just go in for the steal, but you know, this is gonna be what's hard for him to do. Wah, it's a It's a separate, guys. But the lamp is a bit set. Yeah, you see him going in. Ah, yes. Elmah, can I? But it's got a camera. Oh, the pun scarab. Double kill. Flaptizi punya mortal, sornya mati, net tipis, kayak itu net, aduh. Tinggal net sama udil ya, sama-sama gak ada jungler. Mau langsung end kah guys? Mau langsung end kah? Lama loh ini comebacknya bro. Net. Yeah, 30 seconds Isumpa before the lah. others are up. They're gonna go for Nets. There's the circling eagle all time. It's only Odile and Nets left oh, to defend the base. End, guys. Sumpah lah, sumpah lah. Wih, wih, wih. Walawe. Wah, gila, guys. 2-0 diamankan oleh IP brand sang juara dunia ya, guys. Ya, Oke okay lah, guys. Ya, gak apa-apa. Masih ada lower bracket. Kita lanjut aja ke match selanjutnya, guys. Ya, match selanjutnya, guys. Bukan game selanjutnya. Bye-bye. Mantap, Odile. Pengaruh besar impact besar juga, guys. Nah, 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 nah. Bentar, guys. Ini yang dapetin MVP Ogun ya guys ya Dan Nets yang dapetin MVP juga ya Ini Cibi Waduh kayak coklat gini guys ya Udil nah kan Yang gendong Udil sama Nets ya guys ya Ya gak bisa dilihat dari gini juga sih guys ya Oke lah guys ya Terima kasih semuanya dan bye bye